Hi, I'm Jamie from ESL Teacher 365. In this Canva tutorial for teachers, I'll show you how easy it is to create a lesson plan on Canva for teaching abroad or teaching online. Let's get started. Start by typing lesson plan in the search bar at the top. You have a few different options. Let's go with English lesson plan. And here are a bunch of different templates that you can choose from. I'll select this one and then zoom it in so you can see it a bit better. There are some decorative elements. I'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of those. And if you want to change a color, just click on it, then this box, and then change to whatever color you would like. To change any of the text, just highlight it with your mouse and then you can type in what you would like instead. I'm gonna change this to time, homework, and vocabulary. On the left, click text, add a heading, and then you can change the font. Then you're just gonna use the corner to drag it to change the size, and then I'll show you a little trick here. So if you want it to fit between the lines, then drag it between two of the lines, get it to fit, and then you can add it back up to the top. I'm gonna to justify it to the left, highlight, and then write what I would like. So warmer, jobs, brainstorm, in pairs. And then just continue to add whatever you'd like and you can drag that corner so it fits perfectly. Click copy, control V to paste. And then you can just drag the edges to make it fit better. Highlight and then add whatever you would like and then just drag the corner to make it fit. So the magic of editing, I've just kind of gone ahead and sped this up so it's not too boring for you. So add in whatever you would like, and then it should look something like this. You can also use the copy paste method for the date and time. And then I'm going to change this to level. Up top, this is going to be the file name, so you can add whatever you'd like to save it as. So A2 jobs lesson plan. Then you can copy the whole lesson plan and continue to make plans for other days. Or I like to add a page, get rid of any color, then go over to elements, search for some graphics or photos that maybe I'd like to use in flashcards or a presentation later. So it's just a great way to kind of keep everything together and organized. So I'll get some ideas here. So it looks like this. To save it, just click this button and then you have lots of different options. I'm going to go ahead and just save that first page, so not my pictures, and then click download. And it should look something like this. Now, if you don't want to deal with the lines, if that stresses you out, just get rid of them. And you can just put the text on there like that. And if you prefer to write in your lesson plan by hand, just get rid of the text and just use that as your template. If you'd like to get access to thousands of templates and millions of photos, clip art, and videos, then make sure to check out my link down below to try Canva Pro for one month for free. I use Canva Pro to create all my teaching materials for teaching abroad and online, and I'm sure you're going to love it. If you'd like to learn how to make an animated or printable children's book on Canva, then you can check out this video, or if you would prefer to make a worksheet on Canva, then take a look at this video. I hope you enjoyed today's Canva tutorial for teachers on how to create a lesson plan on Canva. Don't forget to subscribe for more teaching tips and tutorials and give this video a like if you learned something new today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Happy teaching and creating on Canva.